Hi, welcome back. Today I'm gonna show you how to generate a Google API key for you to automatically translate your website using Translate Press. Translate Press is a multilingual plugin that helps you easily translate your WordPress website both manually and automatically. With the free version of Translate Press, you can use Google Translate's automatic machine translations for your content, but if you choose the developer or business pro versions, you can also opt for DeepL. But no matter which service you choose, in order for the automatic translations to work, you'll need an API key. Today, however, we'll go with the Google Translate option, and so I'm going to walk you through generating a Google API key for your automatic translations. To start it off, first you'll have to go to Google Cloud Console and log into your account. If you don't have an account, you'll have to create one before you start. Next, you'll want to go to your projects from the top of the page and create a new one. Give your project a suiting name and then hit the Create button. Now you're gonna select your newly created project and then in the sidebar to the left, hover over APIs and Services and click on Dashboard in the menu that appears. Once you're in the API's dashboard, the next step is to enable the API you need. For this, click on Enable APIs and Services and then search for the Translation API in the search bar. Select the Cloud Translation API and enable it by clicking the blue button. The Google Cloud setup is now complete, so let's get our credentials. Go to the Credentials tab from the menu to the left and then click on Create Credentials at the top of the page. Select API key from the dropdown and just wait for Google to fetch your brand new key. Because you want your API to stay safe and sound, we recommend restricting it to your website only so nobody else can use it. To do this, click on Restrict key and then select the HTTP Referrals checkbox. This will open a new field right underneath where you'll input your website URL. Click Done and then save your changes. All that is now left to do is copy your newly generated API key and then add it to your site. So with your key copied, go to your WordPress dashboard. Assuming that you already have the Translate Press plugin installed, if not, click on the link in the top right corner of the video to learn how to do that. We'll now navigate to the Translate Press settings area. From here, go to the Automatic Translation tab and enable Automatic Translations by choosing Yes from the drop-down. Make sure that your translation engine is set to Google Translate and then paste your API key in the empty field below. You can also limit the number of characters to be automatically translated every day in order to make sure you stay within your budget. Keep in mind that Google Translate lets you translate 500,000 characters per month for free, and if you exceed that limit, you'll need to pay for your usage. Now save your settings and let's add a language to your website for Google to automatically translate. Go to the General tab of Translate Press Settings and in the All Languages section, choose your desired language. In this case, I'm adding Spanish. Save your changes and let's put Translate Press to work. Visit your website from the front end and just like that, you and any visitor can now enjoy all of the site's content in your language of choice. Feel free to use the visual translation editor to correct the text if needed or tweak any translations that don't sound natural to you. And that's it! You should now have a perfectly functional multilingual website that is automatically translated by Google Translate. For more information on how Translate Press works, check out the documentation linked in the description. And for more useful WordPress tutorials, you can always subscribe to our channel. Give this video a like if you found it helpful and see you next time. Thanks for watching!